Families living in part of the National Hills neighborhood are without water right now. This is a live look for you at the repair happening tonight after a water main break on the 2400 block of Forest Park Road. Those crews definitely working late. We do have some video to show you from earlier tonight. This shows the water flowing all over the road in that area. Crews have been on site since around 8 tonight. Utilities Director Tom Weedmeyer says the water could be flowing again before midnight, but right now, no word on what caused the break in the first place. Tonight's water main break, the latest problem, though, for Augusta's Utilities Department. Tomorrow, Augusta commissioners are expected to talk about some of the problems and what they can do to try to prevent them. Commissioner Bill Lockett adding the item to the agenda after brown water started spewing out of faucets for families living near Dean's Bridge Road. Disgusting stuff there. Utilities Director Tom Wiedemeyer says sediment actually caused that discoloration. It was stirred up because of some work to repair a valve that was leaking. Commissioners also questioning Wiedemeyer about the boiled water advisory that affected about half of the county last month. And work to improve the look of the James Brown Plaza destroys the roots of six large trees. Tomorrow, commissioners will talk about possibly spending money to remove those trees and what they could be replaced with. Workers accidentally cut into the roots while they were doing some irrigation work as part of the landscaping project. And time running out for Augusta commissioners to put a new drone ordinance in place. City leaders agree drones should be grounded during Masters Week so pilots won't be able to fly over the Augusta National. But not every commissioner agrees with the plan to ban drones from flying over crowds of more than 100 people without written permission from the sheriff's office.